Hey guys, how are you? Ten of Cups, yay! <laughs> What's going on for you guys? This is Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for Earth Signs for December 12th. We're looking to see what's going on for you guys. Um, if you are, we are looking to shake, shake things up a little bit in, uh, just saw King of Swords, in um, 2019. So if there's some things you really want me to do that I haven't been doing, please let me know. Put them in the comments. Uh, try to, we'll try to, Colleen is coming on uh, more full time in 2019. So that will free me up to do a lot more things, which is really cool. We're going to be doing more retreats. We're going to be doing... Uh, more different different kinds of readings that people are really looking for that you know the twin flame we're gonna keep doing that we're gonna you know keep going down some roads that we have been I don't want to get rid of anything that people like but if there's something that I haven't been doing that you're looking for please let me know all right earth signs what is up for you okay what is going on for you guys seven of Pentacles waiting for it's not like like three of three of wands is waiting for your ships to come in this is like similar in that you're waiting for things to come to bloom to full, full fruition right um ten of cups shows up again I feel like you've been in a situation with somebody that was difficult there's a new chance here there's a new chance here okay uh, I feel like the person you're connected to got their heart broken a little bit. Overarching energy of the reading. Nine of Wands. There's some baggage here. This is a person you've been over the jumps with a couple of times here. So, um, this person, Three of Swords, might have been connected with you and they might feel like it didn't go work so well for them. They're going toward Ten of Cups. They're wanting something better in their life. Um, they've had an awakening, a spiritual awakening. Okay, you, I feel like you want relationship in your life here, but you're, I feel like you have a couple people that you're juggling. There's a lot of responsibilities you're juggling. You're juggling your house and your kids and your ex, and maybe your ex is not an ex yet. So there's, um, there's lots of juggling here, but you're sort of like, this is like, expecting things to just sort of happen without you doing anything because you've already got too much on your plate. Okay. Um, Ace of Wands, a new fresh start, something new coming here to you, Earth sign. This is interesting. Going in two different directions. If this person that you're connected to here, I feel like you're going to go in two different directions. They could be an air sign. They could be angry with you because of this three of swords here. Okay. They could be angry with you. And if you offer a new chance, they, you might not, it might not be all that good to do that. <laughs> so let's see here. Um, this judge judgment, 10 of cups person. Yeah. Single. They're single. Okay. Um, you, okay. Yeah, I feel like you're you're you feel stuck to me here. Not I don't know stuck cuz this doesn't seem like you want to get out of it. 4 of wands, 10 of wands. It's overwhelming. Lots of responsibility, okay? Earth sign always earth sign. You always have a lot of responsibility. What are we talking about? But there's something here about making choices. I feel like you don't want to make a choice. You're not interested in making a choice. And that's why this other person got their heart broken because you didn't make a choice and making, not making a choice is making a choice. Okay. Um, where are you going here? Queen of swords. This person is going to bring, yeah, seven of wands, resistance to you, emperor. I, I feel like, um, there's some control issues here. I feel like this uh, this is just going to devolve into something that's not that good. Um, I feel like they think you might be a narcissist of some sort. Or they are. I don't know. But there's something here about them speaking the truth. There's resistance to the truth. Um, you're very uh, resistant to that uh, emperor. 
You really know what you want, taking charge, taking control of your life. They're taking control of their life too, resisting you. So this feels just like a stalemate to me. There's a stalemate here. No one's making choices, but you could call it, it could be called a draw. Like I'm going this way, you're going that way, whatever. That's the new idea. The new idea is, okay, let's just part, part ways. Let's just part ways. There's not like, it doesn't feel like a tower moment to me, but if you're not making a choice, they're making a decision to move ahead. They're making a choice. And that doesn't go so well with the emperor. The emperor wants to make all the choices, right? So if they're taking control and they're moving on while you stand still, then um, that emperor is not going to feel that good about that. That's why there could be a little bit of an argument or a fight or something like that. It's like you can't... Lack of making a choice is still making a choice, like I said. And... So they're going, okay, well, I can see you're not, you're not doing anything. So I have to make a choice for myself because things don't stand still. Things do not stand still. Okay. Everything is moving all the time. Everything is growing. Everything is changing all the time. We are constantly evolving. You can't stand still. Can't stand still. Okay. So let's see where we go with this. I'm going to use a separate deck to see what happens here and you know where what's your best in your best interest i want to see what this person does and how this might unfold for the two of you okay all right so click on the link below this is earth sign december 12th i will see you on the other side